Today, we've got not one, but two celebrities in our reasonably priced car. At the moment, Nick Frost from uh, films such as Hot Fuzz and Shaun of the Dead is out doing his lap. And later on, we've got Simon Pegg. So we're gonna see who's fastest around the track. At the moment, Nick Frost's getting on pretty well. Let's see how he does. Finding our reasonably priced car. Um, it's all right. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know if I'd like to get into all this just to go to the shops and that, but it's not. Does it come with this as standard? All the yeah, always. Yeah. Yeah. yeah why not? You got a bit of grass on the wheels, so yeah, good. You seem to be exploring the track quite a lot. <laughs> I think that's my job as a as an actor, you know, to explore. What? <laughs> I think I'm fume high. <laughs> I am, but it's my second time. So, but I did the I did the uh, the other one, the Lasetti, I think. Yeah, we've got a new car, a new Stig. I know, Stig 2.0. I hear is better, more reliable. <laughs> How are you feeling? Uh, I am nervous. You know, it's it's good. I find Stig 2.0 a, a better presence than previous incarnation. No wonder he was upgraded. Um, so it's. Uh, I just want to remember his words in my head, rather than panic and wet myself. You know. We did um, 1.48.5. Yes last time in the Lasetti. Yeah. So do you think you can beat that time? I'm hope well this is a nippier car. I'm hoping I would. If I don't then I haven't driven as well. If I can beat the the time then I've i I'm I'm a, I'm still a good driver or I'm still an okay driver. But I'd expect to beat it in this because this is a faster car. It feels faster. It feels sportier, you know. I'd have one. <laughs> It's like, it's so much to think about. It's an incredibly concentrated activity. But Are there any corners that you're finding quite challenging? I used to, I like, I really like Hammerhead last time and I'm finding that a little more challenging this time. I don't know if it's because the car is just slightly faster and I'm, I'm I don't know, but um, it's this last one that's always stumped me. It's getting the right speed into it, knowing when to brake, all that stuff really flummoxes me. So, you know, I'm an average driver. It's going to be an average time. <laughs> <laughs> so you and Nick haven't had a bet on who's going to win I today? I think Nick, win. Nick grew up in Essex. Say no more. <laughs> Yeah, it's all right. I, I've done one good one, I think, but the rest have been really poor. You a little bit? Yeah. I little bit. It's starting to rain. You should get this in before you go. <laughs> Come on. You all right, Dan?
I was looking at the other camera. You're here to drive our reasonably priced car, but you're also here to talk about your new film, Paul. Well, it's two comic book geeks, played by us, Simon. Sorry, I'm still buzzing oh, from my laugh. Um, and they uh, find an alien in a crashed Kia Seed and, uh, and, and decide to help him get home, essentially, and then a hilarious road movie ensues. Yes, that's it. Maybe an idea for Paul 2. Paul's? Paul 2, the Paul's. Yeah, the, the Z on the end. The, the, the Kia. kids are like it. The, the Kia adventure. Um, yeah, it's it's a road movie, which is a, a fitting for Top Gear. <laughs> Stop looking at my helmet. Looking at the, the width of it. It's not the first time you said that. Either sentence. <laughs> but you both enjoyed your time here. Oh, yeah, time. yeah, it was amazing. I did. I feel like I could have done better. It was good to 